What's going on YouTube? This is the phone guy here bringing you a video tutorial on how to load MIUI on the Samsung Infuse 4G. Right now I am currently running Serendipity S7 ROM overclocked 1.6 gigahertz. So we are going to go from that to MIUI. First thing you need to do is head on over to xdadevelopers.com and we're going to go into the development section and we're going to go ahead and go to development and now we're going to go find <clears throat> MIUI where is that? there it is Sorry for the shakiness, my uh, little stand I have for my camera is not working, so I'm having to do this and the computer. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and download from this link here. This is going to give you the latest MIUI. Ooh, that's the right one. Yeah, alright. <laughs> Sorry. Alright, so we're going to download that. It's going to give you the latest MIUI. And then you're just going to follow these simple instructions. Place MIUI on your zip, the internal SD card. We're going to reboot into Clockwork Mod. Wipe data, factory reset. Wipe the catch. And then we're going to flash MIUI. So let's go ahead and go to the phone and check that out. Alright, so from S7 to get to Clockwork Mod. You are not going to do that, obviously. Oops. Maybe if I get it to work for me. Hold the power button. Choose the option that says recovery. And we'll give it just a second here. Let it boot up. <coughs> Sorry. Getting over a cold here, so... <laughs> So, take just a couple more seconds here. Alright, so, as you notice, I have a red recovery. You need to flash MIUI from a red recovery. At least, this is what I've been doing, and it's worked fine for me. So, let's go ahead and follow the instructions here. We're going to wipe data, factory reset, select yes. Alright, let it do its thing. That was, whoops. <laughs> that was relatively fast. And we are going to go into advance. And we're going to write, wipe the catch here. And something that I always do, I always hit fix permissions. And we're going to wipe the catch partition as well. Just from old school ROM flashing, it's wipe, wipe, wipe. So wipe everything you can before you flash something new over. So now we're going to go to install zip from SD card. Choose zip from SD card. And we are going to go to the latest MIUI is 1.10.7. And we're going to hit install. Okay, Give it just a minute here. Let it finish doing its thing. All right. That was fast. It is complete. Alright, so next thing you need to do, go back and reboot system now. Now we're going to give it just a little bit here. If we get hung up on the Samsung screen, we'll do step two of the instructions. Which again, just to recap while we're waiting. If it doesn't boot, you pull the battery, put it back in, hold volume up, volume down, and the power button. Let go of the power button as soon as you see the Samsung text. Wait till the blue C Clockwork Mod recovery shows. Flash it again and enjoy. Alright, so it looks like we're going to be hung up on that screen here. <clears throat> I'm going to go ahead and put the camera down real fast. And we are going to have to remove the infuse from my case as I drop it. 
pop the battery out put it back in now we're going to hold down both volume keys and the power button or as soon as that Samsung text reads I let go of that power button there and as you can see we now have a blue clockwork mod so we're gonna go ahead and install that one more time so go to install sorry let me see if I get it anyway it's kinda hard to see real quick let me zoom in All right, install zip from SD card choose zip from SD card and let's go ahead and find MIUI again And we're going to go, yes, install MIUI. And it should be quick, just like the other one was. Again, I'm sorry if the camera is shaky. Uh, hopefully I'll get a new stand here pretty soon. Let it finish. All right, install from SD card complete. Go back, and we are going to reboot system now. I have yet to put my case and back back on, just in case it hangs up on me again. I can try those steps one more time. Oh. first boot usually takes the longest but as you can see it's going to go through this time you got the little MIUI boot screen here alright and there we have it we are now successfully running MIUI the latest release Go ahead and swipe down here. I watch you through all the little first notifications here. So a little bit slow to start up with. I guess it's still settling in. So yeah, latest MIUI 1.10.7. So let's go ahead and go check out settings here. It's been a little bit since I played with MIUI, so give me just a second out phone. Alright, there we have it. So Android 2.3.5 shows you your processor and your storage information. Yeah, there it is. Successfully running. Um, of course, this is what it's going to look like when you first install it. Again, if you're not familiar with MIUI, there's some great threads on XDA that'll kind of tell you about it, what you can do with it. Um, the biggest thing about MIUI is its theming ca capabilities, which you can download themes online or local. We're not going to do any of that quite yet. Um, yeah, it's usually a pretty snappy ROM here. Uh, you can overclock it. Of course, I do not have set CPU on here yet. Which actually, let's go to File Explorer. APK. No, nope, I do not have it right now. Alright, so I'll do another video probably tomorrow after the ROM settles in a little bit and kind of go over some of the performance aspects of it and we'll show you what this ROM can do. But this is it for now. That's how you flash MIUI. Uh, watch my other videos. If you like my work, give me the thumbs up or um, subscribe to my videos. I'll be doing more here in the future. And yeah, thanks for watching.